Hey everybody, if you don't know, my name is Jessie and I'm the Dirt Bike Girl. And this is my ride from Saturday. And I decided to spend the day trying to record and ride with as many kids as I possibly could. I didn't get to ride with all of them, but I got a lot of them. So you can see it's early still. There's only a few people here, but one of my favorite riders is already here. This little nugget. <laughs> we all know her. I record her a lot. And she's got her new 50 and she's gone. I gotta hurry up. <laughs> this girl's <is> fast. <laughs> so. She is a lot faster than I was expecting. <laughs> and I rode with her on Thursday and it was really muddy. And now that it's dried out some, she's just gone. <laughs> I had a lot of fun with riding with her, and later on in the day, I'm going to have some video of me riding with her sister, who doesn't get enough attention. She is doing such a wonderful job. She just moved up to a clutch bike, and I've got some great video of her later on. So make sure you stick around to see that. I just This girl just makes my day all the time. I mean, how can you not smile when you see her? Oh, me still trying to work on little wheelies. <laughs> Woo! You're hard to keep up with today. Keep going, little one. I'll see you later. All right. And then over to ride with this little one. He was a little nervous when he first came out here, but man, Watch him progress as the day goes on. We start out on the oval first thing. He's just getting back used to the bike again. And you can see he's a little hesitant. It's a little slippery out there. But as more and more kids show up, he's gonna get going. This kid had the biggest smile, a most adorable smile when I asked him to ride with me. And that, that made my day. Look at him putting his leg out around the corner. I try to ask everybody's names. I don't always get them all. It's just hard to keep track of everybody. So I'm sorry. I'm not going to try names today because I don't want to mess up anyone's names. But here was two other little ones out here. I didn't get a chance to get their names. But guys, please get these kids boots. girl I was talking about earlier she just moved up to a clutch look at her standing and she's really getting this clutch bike down I rode with her on Thursday in the mud too she was super fast super impressed with this girl I love getting to ride with the girls too you know that's one of my favorite more women in this sport both her and her sister going around the course like pros the little one stands through the right-handed corner because it's rough and she knows to stand through rough terrain so that's great and then up the steep hill like it's nothing man these kids they just am so impressed by them all right now i'm gonna swing back behind this guy now he's taking on the whole course. This is one of his first trips around it. And this is not an easy little course. This uh, dirt is very slippery. It does not dry out very quickly. You can see how rough it is through this section. <clears throat> what a great job. <clears throat> He's not ready to tackle the big hill yet, but he makes a great decision and goes out here onto the grass to go up. There's, I always try and remind people, they're like, oh, I can't go off the dirt, man. These are off-road bikes, they can go anywhere. <laughs> All right, 
Van Jackson and Coco arrived. We've seen both these kids before. They just got these two, both of them not related, but they both got two strokes for Christmas and they came and took a lesson at the same time, learning on the clutch, learning on the two stroke and became really good friends. And now they're out here doing their thing. I got to ride with them for a good long while today. Really enjoyed it. It's a lot of fun when you get to ride with kids like this. Look at that. So it's only been a month of riding for both of these riders and wow have they progressed. <clears throat> I remember back a month ago when starting off was a big ask and now look at them. Oh, it's the best part of the job. This really, truly is. Okay, gotta chase these kids down. We're heading out into the four mile track, which is really uh, 6.2 miles long. Try and get some footage of them riding out here. I didn't want to get in front of me. All right, then we headed over to the motocross track and my GoPro messed up right away. It was not on tight enough. So I didn't get very much footage out there the first time I went out. But I got one cool shot of me, so I wanted to show that. Anyways, it started out, it's already kind of go, gonna go down. And then I'm gonna go over and jump and it's gonna be pointed straight down. Okay, so now it's pointed down at my handlebars and I'm about to go over the step up and it's a lot bigger than I expect. Here we go. <laughs> Woo! Anyways, now we're straight down, which is kind of a cool shot, actually. How often do you see this view? Anyways, we'll move on. It's about the kids. All right, caught back up with this little one. Look at him out on the four mile track. So impressive. I just love it. All right, now it's afternoon time. Everybody's feeling really good. Riding really good. Here's Jackson on um, the trials bike. So, like I said, I've been working on wheelies all day long, and of course, since I've been working on wheelies, the rest of the kids start working yeah, on wheelies. It's a little weird. It's oh, vibrating. here's a little video of Jackson trying yeah. to kickstart the trials bike. Like I can't kickstart this bike. I have to find someone who's a big adult to, to kickstart it. So, here's his attempt. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> all right, and now here's him trying to do a wheelie with a trials bike. There we go. Another little one. Another little <laughs> one. He's starting to get there. Now he's got it. And here is Colston trying to do wheelies on the trials bike. He's never done this before. He's trying to figure it out. I'm going to stop in a second and give him some advice on it. He's just trying. He's just see monkey see monkey do. He's trying to copy what we did. So I'm going to give him some advice. And later on, he's going to figure it out. And look at him standing. Ah, confidence coming. Confidence coming. Ah. Now watch out for the little one. Oh, then you're so silly. <laughs> Standing all the way through the corner. Look at that. Woo. All right, headed out to the motocross track. Now that I've tightened down my uh, GoPro so I can get some more. Of course, they take off and they're gone. They're, they're motocross kids. I can't keep up with them. 
But I had a little bit of fun out on the motocross course myself. I don't get to ride on it very often. It's not my thing. I'm a hair scrambles person. But I've been playing around with it, trying to do a little more. And I didn't have my seat on, and it's hard to do these berms standing, but I figured it out. I think I can jump this second one right here, all the way. It's not that far. I'm gonna try it sometime. I need a little advice, but not too much, guys. I don't want everyone's advice, but I, I don't really know how to do it. So I need a little bit, and I'm gonna go to my coach to get it. <clears throat> the anthill this time it's hard to do the anthill standing too so I messed it up a little bit but no big consequence didn't overdo the step up this time <laughs> man that last one scared me a little bit and this step down really scares me I'm always cautious on this one I need to work on riding in the ruts more. Can't wait for AJ to come. That's going to be a great lesson. Alright, then I head over to catch up with some other to record. I think it's Jackson. Yep. Look at him doing that berm. Very nice. We need to work on this a little bit, but like I said, he's only been riding for a month. He's never been taught out here on the motocross course. And we need to get out here and teach him a couple of things that'll really help him. Otherwise, man, he's doing such a wonderful job. I heard he took a crash later on in the day, which we all do. I got a couple of crashes today on video. And it's just part of it. Coco figuring out the wheelie. <laughs> he came back holding his heart, said it scared him to death. And lastly, Denise going through a very tough wood section and making good decisions. So she starts to go this way and is like, uh, no, this does not Just work for me. Your front tire where you want to go, keep your eyes ahead. Alright. Great job everybody. And remember, if you're having a bad day, it's only one hey, down guys, and the rest down. is up. Remember to su subscribe, That's like, and do. comment, please. <laughs> 